Doop, doop. Hey, me Bob Schools. Welcome to the stream. We are on part 13. And yes, I'm wearing me puffer vest because it's a bit chilly and I couldn't be bothered putting on a hoodie. Anyways, that's that. Uh, we're doing this one. We're speaking to Sebastian. Let's get into it. <laughs> uh, oh, good. No, it's not like that. Oh, the controller keeps changing color. Green, turquoise, aqua, white, purple, light, light, purple, lilac. Whoop. Doesn't matter. All fun and games. Uh, let's go. Oh, he's here. Did you speak with my uncle? I wish I had better news about your uncle and nice. Anne. Well, what did he say? Not I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. <laughs> Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. <sighs> if he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form, and that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne, to reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Hmm. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. Yes. That is fine. I'll send you an owl when I have news. Send me an owl. Um, uh, that's fine. Uh, do I have a look? No, oh, I made him there then. Mm, trouble. Yes. Shane Bardolf thought dark magic. I should dismount here. I yeah. thought my owl might pique your interest. I came as soon as I could. I'd been so preoccupied <laughs> by all that happened with Ominous in the catacomb, not to mention my uncle's reaction, that I'd almost forgotten what it was that struck me about that triptych. This is the view painted on the canvas that was left on it. That's incredible. You know this area well. And while I was waiting for you, I scouted around and discovered an abandoned mine nearby, surrounded by Ranrock's loyalists. Do you think there's a connection to the triptych? I've no idea, but perhaps they're searching it, the way they did Brookwood Castle and Isadora's Manor. How do we want to handle this? We need to see what they're doing. I say we take them head on. Let's bury some enemies. Very well. And I still have that rune symbol we found on the triptych. If there is a connection, I suspect we'll see that symbol again. Head on it is. After you. Can we fly? No, obviously. <laughs> I have my controller doesn't need charging. I did charge it for a bit. The last pretty good There they one. are up ahead. I'll let you lead. Yes. We'll yes. what is right for no me. one enters this mine. Kill anyone who tries. <laughs> Ranrock's loyalists are out for blood. Rather unwise coming back this way. Easily a diversion. This is sad. Really, it is. Expelliarmus. That was meant for me. Incendio. Thanks for the bitch. Oh, shit. I've been fighting with him. Expelliarmus. Oh, 
here. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Put me down. Oh, and what? Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work. Revelio. Yeah, all that crap is full, as always. Oh yeah. Oh snap! That's way higher. Let me just push off. Guess. Get rid of it. Ah, uh, the scarf we can change, eh? Oh, this one's higher. That's right. <laughs> it's worth so much. So much. Uh, don't need that. Yeah. That's worthless as well, but we'll keep it. No headwear. It goes. Oh, it's higher level, so it's nice to keep, eh? Revelio! This is going well. We make a good team. We do at that. Once again, we could fight our way through or be discreet. You know which one I'd choose. Perhaps we can find an alternate route up ahead. Hello? Sneaking around has its appeal. Bombarda. You're weak, human. I shall avenge your death. Potato. Uh, 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 uh. You are pathetic. You won't get away with that. Get him, Potato. Confringo. Bombarda. Release me! Impressed? The ball! Put me on the ground now! I shall avenge your death! Confringo! Confringo! Accio! Expelliant! Confringo! And the fun is over. Fun is a relative term. <laughs> it is. And that was relatively fun. Revelio. Pinch traps cut, eh? Hey? Huh. 
It's good that we're getting those good old vials. Like I'm always a pinch of level. I should tell you, rumor is this mine was closed long ago due to an infestation of spiders. How nice. Nothing I haven't seen before. That's the spirit. Huh. Yes. We're making quick progress. Just want to see if there's anything here. Or if this was just a different pathway. Seems like it. Yeah. Let's avoid all this. <laughs> Nothing to it. But they get through it. Get rid of you. And the scarf. That's right. It was green. Give us two more points. For now, yes. It's higher level, so we use it. Do we have points? We do. Uh, what can we put on? Oh, so close. Must be able to cast a Kadabra. Feeling a curse that may restore some of your health. Be able to cast Avakadava to unlock this talent. We have to learn it. Hmm. Here we go. For better or for worse. <laughs> Expelliarmus! Incendium! Ah. Ah. I won't rest until you're dead. Confringo! Ah. 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 This mine looks like a tomb. It was closed after accidents were reported. Now I see why. I don't see any goblins in these webs. Too disgusting for even a spider to prey on. Loyalists are in here. <sighs> Too many. They definitely think there's something here they want. Revelio. Yeah, that way. Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> that ledge is awfully high. Any ideas? Yeah, I got an idea. Really? Oh man. Gonna be a problem, aren't ya? This one's less. This one's less. Oh, I got two slots now. <sighs> Incendio! Rebellion. 
wait. No, let's wait late. We got him, Leviosa. Must be something around here that can help. Arrest the momentum. It's no wonder spiders give people goosebumps. Could be the hairy legs, or the solar size, or the venomous fangs, or any number of endearing qualities, really. Bombarder! Many, many reasons. Because there's going to be another box that comes up, and then, yeah, it'll be pointless. A top hat. Oh, not good. Is there something else? It was. Another hat? Smashing. Should have thought to conjure stairs. Bombarda. Incendio. Rebellion. That bridge has seen better days. Yes. Incendio! Elf made gloves. Oh, yeah. Uh, gloves, gloves. They're higher than increase. Got oh, glasses. Oh, exactly the same level. And two. Eh, we can see his eyes a bit. Can always take him off. Repair him. We've read the world of another spider. I shall sleep better tonight. <laughs> Revelio. Bombarda. There it is. I'm gonna see if we can get money. Revelio. Down here. Oh. I will get it. Huh. 
that he's doing. Hmm. Rebellion. On the other side. That look funky. And this, rip this. Oh, what was it? What else I had? I could get rid of. Should have got rid of it. Maybe it was just those. So it's just more valuable. Keep it to get more money back. And the gloves, that's right. There we go. Five spaces now. Yeah. We're making quick work of them. Professor Hecate would be proud. She would at that. Ramrock's loyalists have all but declared war. Incendio. Spikes. Send you. Bombarder. Jumper, school uniform, pal. Yeah. Finding a lot of crap here, eh? Uh, yes. It does do increased damage when bombarded, though. That's alright. And that's unidentified. Rebellion. Congringo. Expelliant. Echo Protego. Rebellion. We've still not seen a single rune symbol. I think we're going to be a bit distracted from runes for a moment. An unwelcome distraction. We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not mm. surprised? Yes. Save we haven't saved in a while, eh? Confringo! 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 Confringo!
We certainly cleared the room. Ooh, yeah. I don't know why Gryffindors get credit for bravery. We Slytherins are teeming with it. Ugh. And we're much more fun to fight with. <laughs> so that would say different things. Depending on Rebellion. The house you're in. Lovely. Um. Bombarder. Incendio. We can have a look around in peace. Oh. Rebellion. That's too symbol there. If I were to pull that box over. Wingardium Leviosa. Arrest the momentum. Rebellion. Is there a chest? Maybe it leads to something else. I assume huh. then we do go here. Incendio! And this one. Wingardium Leviosa! A rune symbol above the cavern door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. That. Then I did that. Maybe I have to figure it out. No freaking idea. Rebellion. Got a book. What do you have there? A journal. And Sebastian, I think I found Hopefully something. It will help us unravel more piece. of this mystery. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, something about this place feels odd. Incendio! Expelliant! Bombarder! Confringo! Clasis! Confringo! Revelio! Hmm, check on Sebastian. Oh, yeah. Oh, there he is. Oh, sorry. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols and ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic Jeez. too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Well, this is all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. This place is odd, to be sure. But I'm fascinated by it. Now... For the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. Unless we can find another passageway to the Undercroft. Let's have a look around. Uh. Rebellion! There we go. Easy. 
And now for the moment of truth. It has to fit. Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. <laughs> I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mara and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? All this time, I mean, we've stop, been a step why. behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? A friendly goblin. He wants no part in Ranrock's fight. A friendly goblin? Mm -hmm. You know, goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, but not all goblins not are... Not all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? Perhaps your uncle was right about you. You don't know when to stop. Oh, I do know when to stop. Jeez. Unbelievable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> right in the butt. Uh, we need to... And sell these thingy jigs. Let's go to Okay yeah. See what the I hope Professor Fitzgerald has confirmed. Up. I believe my next broom upgrade to be even more impressive than the last. Come by spin witches as soon as you can. Done done. Oh, we got a rope. Killed the cure rope. Nice. Where the hell is everything? Oh, that's waiting for a level. Um, glasses. We're waiting for a level. What is higher? Hat. There is a new hat in town. Um, increase ancient magic meter fill rate. That look a bit funny with that. Sell, sell, sell. Delta curse targets. Whoa, fancy. Celtic one. Get rid of everything else, eh? Somewhat. Map. Hogs made. Sell to Jay Pippins. He don't mind. We can get a broom shop. Whoa, what is this stool? We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. Um, sell, sell. Oh. So, this is so, so, from part of the so, so, lower. This one will keep. I hope to. Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. Saved me a lot of time and trouble. Reach level 23, eh? Um, where is... Ravanda. Over brims. That's what we need to get to. Hello again. Wonderful to see you. Yes. As before, I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. Jeez. 
Jeez, really? Man. Do these four thousand? Screw it. You'll be thrilled with that broom. I promise you. All right. I hope so. A You're all set with the new upgrade. I can't wait to hear what you think. <clears throat> this may sound presumptuous, but you'd like me to report back with even more flight details. <laughs> you know me well. I feel I'm almost there. I just think I can improve broom flight a bit more. Miss Rays is running a time trial at the South Coast course. Not ideal, really, what with rumours of Ramrock's lot and Ashwinders infiltrating the place. However, if you're flying high above them, you should be all right, I think. I'm not worried, Mr Weeks. I'll see if I can find Imelda. I hope you are able to complete these trials. I have a feeling this final upgrade is going to be a sweeping Good. success. <laughs> Do be careful, of course. I shall look forward to hearing from you soon. I look forward to our next meeting. Done, done, done. Uh, we need to do some quests, right? How the hell do I get there? Inside, unless we go through, there's nothing I can suspect. Okay, Revelio. There's a cave of entrance there. Well, this might be the best meal I've had in years. No, I, I mean it. Huh? Enjoy suffering, do you? Expelliarmus! Accio! Oh. 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 Revelio. <sighs> Bombarder. Good To later, right? Sky's the limit. And the food keeper troll. Took the deke. We'll do some missions. Um. Isn't Deke in the... S 
secret room of requirement. Deke would like to talk with you when you have yes, a moment. Deke. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you wanted to tell me more about the loom. Ah, hello. Uh, yes, about that. Deke has had a thought. He... <gasps> Seems the room thinks you need more space for your beasts. Mm. Uh, as Deke was saying, uh, he's had a thought. Now, Deke knows how you can test the item of clothing that you enhanced in the Enchanted Loom. And uh, perhaps help an old friend in the process. What do you mean? A house elf named Tobbs works for his master, retrieving leech juice in a cave near Hogwarts. Tobbs' master doesn't let him leave the cave. And Deke knows the cave is infested with spiders. That sounds awful. It is. Deke hasn't heard from his friend for a while now. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. I understand. Leave it to me, Deke. I'll find Tobbs for you. Oh, thank you. Uh, please let Deke know what you learn about Deke's old friend. Yes. I think this one's closer. What are you up to now? Most gobblers in my family worked in the mines at one time or other. We should speak with Mr. Bickle's friends. I believe I can sneak away without drawing my mother's eye. Meet me near Hogsmeade and we will devise a plan. I think I know how and where to approach the centaurs about protecting the Snidgets. Meet me in the Forbidden Forest. This must be Tobbs' cave. I suppose I should head inside. Accio! Expelliarmus! Incendio! Beware of spiders. Mm, lots of spiders. Incendio. Yeah. Tobbs' master is awful. Tobbs? Tobbs? Deke sent me. Are you in here? Incendio. 
Expelliarmus. Clesis. Accio. Incendio. Looks as if Tobbs was here some time ago. He must have headed deeper into the cave. Incendio. Incendio. Accio. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Bombarda. Incendio. Revelio. Expelliarmus. Accio. Incendio. Accio. Incendio. Revelio. Incendio. Rebellion. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Confringo. Places. The Pulsa. Accio. Incendio. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Bombarda. Rebellio. Incendio. No problem. Rebellio. Let's get free. Expelliarmus! 
Expelliarmus. Incendio. Oh, he's just gonna keep it for you. Debuso. Confringo. Bombarder. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Spider fangs. Revelio. Really? Ah, uh, come on, I should be able to cast the spell like right there. Bombarder! Incendio! Bombarda! Oh no. I have a feeling that house elf is Tobbs. Uh, Master, you find Tobbs, but either speaks but it was too much. Tobbs has failed you and deserved punishment. Weak, slippy, Tubbs must. Poor Tobbs. Left here alone with the spiders. Hmm. That's not good. Revelio. Very sad. Far out. Green, how you doing? Good, good. Just found out Tobbs died, which sucks. Wait a second, I light a fire here. Incendio! Like catches fire. How about you? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. What do you mean that's great? It's not great that Tobbs died. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, we got now. Offer me something, uh, what are you gonna offer me? Revelio! I've been offered many things. What the hell's over here? Go this way first. Swim faster. Can't get to that one. Oh, we got this one. At least you're doing well. Golden, not bugger that. Oh, no, uh, you graphics artists. 
2D, 3D designing. I don't know. I can design logos, banners, emotes. No, thank you. Thanks, but no thanks. I don't think I really need it for a little time that I do stream. I don't stream as much as before. Yes. One day, maybe. I'm trying to make a game. Bombarda! I need maybe graphic design, but more to do with Blender. Maybe some logos and stuff, but that's a maybe. Such commitment I do into my own video game. Just somewhat there. Logo later, again. Logo for my game would come later, it's last thing. Yes. We're gonna leave now, can't we? Can we? I think we're this way. Revelio. Yeah. yeah. No, as I said, not anytime soon. Logo is the last thing I do for my video game. Until I figure out what exact name it is, what the logo is going to be. I have my own idea, but again, if that's suitable for it. Again, thanks, but no thanks. All good, little green. Oh, shite. We can go back to freaking Oh, we can sell that. I like this. It goes really close. Yeah. Bombarda. That's why. That table looks familiar. Seems I'm back at the entrance to the cave. Yes. Way easier. I'll do this for next gen. I think it could have kept loading, no problem. Uh, now we can tell these. Banish these spiders. You ain't gonna be happy. Nope, 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 nope. That's a good idea playing cheerful music. I'm back from the cave, Deke. Sad Wonderful. News. Uh, uh, Deke hopes you gave Deke's best to Tobbs. I'm sorry to tell you this, Deke, but Tobbs is gone. It seems he was unable to avoid the spiders in the end. Oh it would my. my fault if I waited too long. Deke was afraid of this, alone yeah, in that cave for so long. Oh, poor Tobbs. Uh, Deke and Tobbs once shared the same master. When he died, uh, we were separated. 
Dick always wished Tobbs had been sent to Hogwarts too. Mm. Dick feels lucky to serve such kind witches and wizards like you. Dick will miss his friend dearly and will raise a glass to him with a heavy heart. <laughs> I'm truly sorry about your friend, Deke. Thank you. You are very kind. Deke could use some time alone to think, if that's all right. Yes, definitely. Quests. In the Forbidden Forest. Let's go. We've got to level up. Um, closest is here. It's quick though, at least. I can do this. I can do this. They will want to help. Huh. Is this where we're meeting the centaurs? Well, they don't exactly know we're coming, so it's less of a meeting and surprise. more of a surprise, I suppose. Once we tell them about the Snidgets, they'll understand why we came and they'll want to help. Hopefully. I hope you're right. Perhaps they'll be able to tell that we're sincere. There's mm, something about them just that's children so under knowing. 15, 16. It's almost unnerving. I suppose they are known for having an air of omniscience. That's exactly the right word. I just... never mind. What is it? It's nothing, truly. I've... we've no secrets to hide. That's right. We'll simply be honest with them about what we're trying to do. They'll have to help us, won't they? Yes, of course. You're absolutely right. Maybe. We'll meet with them, tell them about the Snidgets, and I'm sure to all be fun. Like this one bit. I don't know why I'm the one wand up. What do you think away. you're doing here, humans? Please! We were hoping to speak with you. Ah! I suppose you'd like a tale for your friends of the time you spoke to a centaur and it spoke back. No! Never! We're here because we need your help. Enough! You made a grave error in judgment in coming here, little witch. Leave them be, Alec. We do not harm the young. It is not our way. You forget your place, old fool. I'm the leader of this herd, and while you cling to our way, their kind continues to slaughter beasts like us without a care. Just kids. From what I can see, they have slaughtered no one. They will leave here unharmed. Mark my words, Doran. If I ever see them again, it will be all three of your heads. <laughs> Foolish children. Do you know what happens to wizards who wander here? Now. Follow me before Golden I... Golden Snidgets are still alive, and the poachers are after them. They know that the key to finding them lies in the moonlight, but they don't know what that means, yet. Please, help us find the Snidgets before the poachers do. Could it be? Yes. In the south, there is a cave within which lies what the poachers seek, a moonstone. Retrieve it, and place it in the henge in the forest. I, on the other hand, must go speak with the herd. Find me after you have done this. Done, done, done. I don't understand. So the moonlight mentioned in the journal doesn't refer to actual moonlight. There you go. But to a moonstone. What do moonstones have to do with snidgets? Ooh, bloody and nice. why was he so certain about where we could find one? Because he knows about. I don't know, yeah, but I, I am inclined to believe him. 
What with his being a centaur and all. I am too. It is a shame how quickly he left. What was his name? Doran. Doran? That's what the leader of the herd called him. Well, if Doran knows something we don't, I'd rather act Duran, now and Duran. ask questions <laughs> later. I can head to the library and start looking into the cave he mentioned. All right, you do that. I'll let Adios. you know what I find. She's gonna disappear? No. No, she's gone library. This is for blackmail. Maybe level 23 still. What's this? Talk to the in the room requirement again? Um, no. Hogwarts. Uh, we can talk maybe to Dick again. Yeah, they got a quest <laughs> upon. Fair a moment. Hmm. <laughs> all it says. Nothing else that I can't do. Sun. Scum and Elder. Can't even get there. So I got only two quests to do here. Let's see what the dig has to say. Oh, let's Hello, see. Let's see. You wanted Play to talk more to me. Indeed. Uh, the dig thought you might want to learn how to build a breeding pen so that you can breed beasts. That sounds like a very good idea. Rescuing and breeding beasts go hand in hand. <laughs> Young beasts are Rise particularly vulnerable to poachers. Breeding beasts here in the room will allow us to keep the younger ones safe. I see. What do I need to do? First, bring a pair of beasts to the room. One male, one female. Deeg suggests rescuing Thestrals, as they're at great risk from poachers. Noble creatures, but their relationship with death gives them a bad reputation. They're prized by poachers for their tail hairs. I've seen Thestrals before, but where would I find a pair of them nearby? Deke has seen some wild Thestrals not too far from the Hogwarts grounds. Then you'll need to purchase a spellcraft for the uh. pen from Tomes and Scrolls and gather the materials it requires. Once you've rescued the Thestrals and you have the spellcraft, you come and find Deke. Ote. That's uh. We're gonna skip that one. Anyway, near. Let's find where she is. Oh, so far away from that. Yeah, we can fly then. Who lived here, I wonder? We wait. Are you ready to put an end to Harlow? Yes. Yeah. I'm ready to do what's needed to take Harlow down. I know you have a plan. We must gather information Magic from blazing. the friends of Mr. Bickle that Archie and Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Agabus Filbert, Otto Dibble, and Mr. and Mrs. Rib. All right. I suggest that you speak with each of them while I head to the Hogshead. I saw some Ashwinders heading there. And as my mother would never go near mm. the Hogshead, she is less likely to learn of my activities than if I were to wander the village questioning its residents. Yes. Very well. I'll speak with them, see what I can learn. I knew I could rely on you. We need to know how they are being blackmailed by Rookwood and Harlow. Meet me here after you have spoken with them. 
done, done. Hopefully, by the time you return, I will be able to move a bit more freely. Hello, yeah. Glad you came. Mrs. Rabe should be nearby. Oh, Isco, what have I done? Mrs. Rabe, I wondered if I might speak with you about Theophilus Harlow. I'm a friend of the Bickles and I'm trying to gather evidence against him. Poor Joanna and little Archie. And now Harlow has taken my darling Isco. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I'm a security guard at Gringotts. And my husband is a curse breaker for them. Mm. Harlow approached me about helping him extort my colleagues into giving him treasures from the vaults. And you declined? Of course I declined. Repeatedly. I thought they'd given up until I came home one night and found my husband gone and a note affixed to my door with a knife. The note stated that I only had a few days to reconsider helping with some banking needs and that my husband would appreciate it if I acted quickly. But the help Harlow wants is help that I cannot give. And my dearest Isco is paying the price. Thank you, Mrs. Rabe. Knowing the lengths that Harlow will go to is helpful, albeit more than disturbing. Mr. Bickle was trying to help us, but now he's gone. I don't know what to do. I shall do all I can to get evidence against Harlow, Mrs. Rabe. Very well. Here's the note I received. You must be careful as well. Please don't put yourself in danger. Sweet. Some evidence worth hanging on to. Thank you. Oh, I hope it's... Revelio. Now, to find Mr. Bickle's other two friends. Hello, Hamora. That was easy. Sweet. Come on. Slow me down. Ah, I'm glad you came. Otto Dibble works at Gladrags. I should check the. But, 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 but please tell me you didn't take it. Mr. Dibble, may I speak with you? It's about Theophilus Harlow. I have nothing to say about him. Uh, may I interest you in a stunning cravat today? Please, sir, I'd like to help. I spoke to Mrs. Bickle. <laughs> you know the Bickles? Mm, all right. Mm. But we must be discreet. Can't have Mr. Hill hearing this. Yes, I yes. I know Mr. Hill. He was kind to me the day of the troll attack. Oh, he's a good man. But even he wouldn't understand about Harlow. It started mm. a few weeks ago. I was distracted, reading a note, when you-know-who came into the shop. I hid the note behind the counter and offered to help him. He stared at me for a moment, then asked me to check on an order he'd placed. I went into the storeroom to check on what turned out to be a non-existent order. When I returned, he was holding the note. What was in the note? It was a note from Rosie Hill, Mr. Hill's daughter. You see, we've been, well, secretly engaged these past six months. We haven't told Mr. Hill yet. I dare say he has higher hopes oh. for her. Harlow Heck. advised me in no uncertain terms that my relationship with Rosie, not to mention my employment here, depended upon my cooperation. What did he ask you to do? It all happened so quickly. In an instant, he took a very expensive scarf from the counter, pocketed it, and smiled. He said, your secret is safe as long as I can supply my lady friend with delightful items like this every so often. I've been able to cover for his request until now with some creative bookkeeping, but I can't keep it out for much longer. Mm. I'm terrified to say anything. I could 
never live without Rosie. Thank you for telling me. I'm gathering evidence to take Harlow down. I would love nothing more than to see him rotting in Azkaban, but be careful. He's an awful man and incredibly dangerous. Yes. As for Rosie's letter, should we'll you see. happen upon it, I have committed it to memory. You may destroy it immediately. Understood. Now hurry off before Mr. Hill returns. Yes, yes. We're on the right track. Now to find the last of Mr. Biggle's friends. Must be around here somewhere. Hello there. Excuse me, Mr. Filbert. I wondered if I might speak with you about your dealings with Theophilus Harlow. I hope to ease Mrs. Bickle's mind by gathering evidence against him. Oh, tragic what happened to Bickle. He wanted me to speak out against Harlow for an act of violence committed against me. But I feared Harlow's retaliation, and so I refused. If you had spoken out against him as Mr. Bickle asked, perhaps Harlow would be locked away by now. Perhaps. But uh, perhaps that, yeah. I would have suffered a similar fate. You said that Harlow committed an act of violence against you. Could you tell me what happened? Before my extraordinary wife, Dulcibella, passed away, she had just completed a small book of poetry. As a surprise for her birthday, one she never had the chance to celebrate, I had the book beautifully bound and plated in gold. One day, Harlow came calling to punish me for having spoken out against the Neanderthals that comprise Brookwood's lot. Before I knew it, I'd been petrified, and Harlow was rifling through my home. He found the book of poetry with its exquisite gold plating. I watched helplessly, lying there in my entranceway as he walked away with the book, laughing as he went. I was shaken to my core. Still am, to be honest. I imagine you fear Harlow retaliating again. But do you mind if I share this information with Officer Singer? <sighs> I suppose I have no choice. This extortion can't go on forever. You can pass it on to anyone who may be willing to help. Sweet. Harlow does not like people talking. As you already know. I've spoken with Mr. Bickle's friends. Now to find Natty. It's not like Natty to be late. She said she was going to the Hog's Head. Perhaps I'll find her there. Not good. Revelio. Always in Brooklyn, in Britain. Uh, has been has been a favorite haunt of to Hogwarts students for third years and up for centuries. <laughs> He must be around here somewhere. Wand. She can cast without it. She's 
She wanted me to find this. She's in trouble. Ravelio will show me where she was taken. Uh. Ravelio! What the heck? I shouldn't write out. The footprints led to this room. There must be another way forward. Akio! Hidden door. That he must have been taken this way. I need to find her quickly. I'd better be sure I'm not seen. Hmm. No, don't worry about that. I don't trust Ranrock. It's not gonna work. Using that girl as bait, that one's coming for us. We ought to just kill her. Only a Hogwarts student would be arrogant enough to come in here alone. Got my eye on fire. What? <laughs> To make this too easy for me.
be anything here. A big treasure chest. Oh. Well, I did collect a lot of things, so. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Let's see what hats we have. Nope. 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 Uh, that's not even higher. Oh, we could leave it. Gonna sell some stuff, right? Yeah, oh, we'll get my stuff anyway. Anyhow, you can do it stealth, but yeah, no. Nah. Otto Dibble's love letter from Rosie. He wanted me to destroy this if I found it. be here somewhere. You found us. I knew you would realize I had left my wound for you. Over here. <laughs> Mr. Rabe, <laughs> Daisy told me you'd been abducted. You spoke with my wife. How is she? Worried about you. Are you all right? I am all right. Thank you for coming. These locks are cursed, and there's an anti-apparition jinx on the cells. Even Natty's skill with wandless magic cannot free us. I need you to find my wand. Use mine. I'll find yours together once you're out of there. I need my wand for this. Fine. Using <laughs> one with which I have no connection may not work as well or as quickly, and we cannot risk detection. I shall do my best. Any idea where it might be? It's nearby. I can sense it. Understood. I'll find it. Mm. Your friend Natty was not able to It must be blocked by something. I want it somewhere. Incendio! Any luck with my wand? Please. Nope. Revelio! I really have no freaking idea.
Mr. Rape's wand could be in there. Could be where? Open shite. I don't know what I was talking about. There, there, as in where. Hmm. Bombarda. Revelio. Really? I've done it so many times. Aloha Mora. Holy crap. Mr. Rabe's wand must be nearby if he can sense it from his cell. Sweet. Mr. Rabe's wand. He'll be glad to have this back. There you go. Mr. Rabe, I found your wand. Well done. I knew it was nearby. Now, you best stand back. One never knows how a curse will react to being broken. Anything you sell? Revelio. Thank you, Mr. Isco. My pleasure. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. I may be too weak to disapparate with you both, but I can try. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Very well. But be careful. Thank you, my young friend. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. I need to find some Rebellio. Book. that was taken from Agabus Felbert. Nice. He'll be thrilled to have this back. Revelio. Some stuff over here. It's the grey. Get to this one. Bombarda. Rebellion. Nothing else, yeah. And leave then. Nice. I get some money back. Upgrading the broom. Find Officer Singer and put an end to Harlow. What? Once and for all. Natsai Onai. I should have known. And you, the troll dispatcher. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Should have known it was you too. Yep. Is Mr. Rabel right? He is. I sent him home to his wife, Miss Onai. 
Your mother will not be pleased to learn that you're still risking your safety pursuing these dangerous men. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashbinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rabe, to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Uh, I will look into all of that. As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Next time, please let the authorities fair, fair. handle the Ashwinders. Yes, officer. Do you have enough evidence to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot? Well, it's certainly a good start. We shall see. But you can leave this to me now. Yes. Natsai, you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. We shall speak soon. Sweet. Getting there. Is he gonna level me up? No. So freaking close. Uh, we could sell some stuff, eh? Hey. Let's um, sell stuff. Uh, we got a nail. Uh, map. Where am I anyway? Uh. What's the point of toiling? Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Revelio. Person of Shinsu Fury is the apothecary in the Hogsmeade where propriety, parry, and sells a wide variety of potions and their ingredients. Yeah, level 23. Just because they're Thank you class. again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. Save me a lot of time and trouble. Some money back at least. Ooh, it's lower. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Revelio. <laughs> Revelio. Lots of places are locked, eh? Goodies in these houses. <laughs> Headless horseman, huh? That's me done, me popsicles. Uh, decently done tonight, I think. Next up, we can do Head Mistress Speaks. Nearly there. Um, yes. We'll see. We will see. Anyways, should be back on, on Friday. Uh, if then on Saturday. And enjoy the rest of the week. Then, let us meet popsicles. Whoop.